Welcome to the Animal's House, everyone. Today, I'm going to show you how I took six dump truck loads worth of topsoil, loaded it up into my dump trailer, hauled it across my yard, and put it on a big pile for storage and future use. Here we go. All right, everyone, let me set the table here as to what we're doing here. I've got a section in the trees where it's always kind of a low area and we're trying to make like an area where nature can build us an ice rink in the winter. So what I did is I drew a 100 foot diameter circle and I tried to grade it all out so that it's perfectly flat so that I'm going to have a clear sheet of ice there in the winter. And so to do this, I had to trim all of the high spots down and get rid of that topsoil material. So uh, to do that, I used a box blade. I used a tiller a little bit to loosen up the ground. Uh, and then I just piled all of the topsoil up on a pile. And when I was done, I was going to worry about it then. So I got everything leveled. I didn't know how much I would have. It turned out I, I ended up having the equivalent of six dump truck loads worth of material that I had to get out of there. And uh, this little area in these trees, it's not like there's a driveway to it, okay? We're in the middle of August. It's dry right now, and pretty soon it's going to be September, and it's going to be wet. I can't get in there. So, uh, Plus, the trees are kind of close together. So I can't get in there with a big machine. I don't have a dump truck. Uh, I don't have a big loader to load a dump truck, even if I borrowed one from somebody. And so how was I going to get that material out of there? So I used the dump trailer. I built that dump trailer, spent a lot of time on it. We really don't use it a ton, but when we do need it, uh, this is a great example of how it is extremely convenient. So I got that thing behind the minivan. I loaded up all, all of these loads. I ended up with 30 loads, which works out to be about six dump truck loads for a quad. And uh, basically got all that stuff out of that lower area while it's dry, hauled it all the way across the yard, and then backed up to the area that I'm going to store that topsoil and then dumped it off and uh, ended up with a pretty big pile out there right now so um, I'll be able to manage that for far more months out of the year compared to that low area where I can really only get in there for one or two months a year so um, I probably would have never hired a contractor to do any of this so this is kind of an example where the ingenuity or uh, you know bravery of tackling a, a dump trailer project like that kind of worked out hopefully it'll work out I'll probably do a video on that ice rink uh, once we get that all complete, maybe in the winter sometime. But I uh, hope you enjoyed the video here, guys. If you like it, please click. And if you haven't already, please subscribe. Otherwise, I'll see you on the next episode of Animal's House.